And it'll be good for another Rockets first down. Spot the ball about the 32, 33 yard line and that is gonna end our first quarter of play. All knotted at zero between the two best teams in Division I juniors right now out of San Antonio District as we'll head into the second quarter. Keep it here, we'll be back here on Typha Radio. Joey Teague, son of Mike and Patty Teague and longtime Typha members, was born with cystic fibrosis. Despite this, Joey went to school, graduated with honors from Judson High School, and attended the University of Texas at San Antonio for three years, all while struggling to stay healthy. Joey also coached in Typha with the Live Oak Jaguars from 1998 to 2006 and was a husband and father. Joey passed away in 2007. The Joey Teague Type of Volunteer of the Year Award was established to recognize and bring attention to the many volunteers who helped make Typha one of the premier leagues in Texas and the nation through heartfelt passion, enthusiastic commitment, and a contagious spirit, all of which epitomized Joey Teague and all that he gave to youth sports. For more information or to nominate a volunteer from your organization for the Joey T. Type of Volunteer of the Year Award, send your nominee's name, contact information, and a short bio as to what makes them a great volunteer. You can send the information to helpdesk at typha.com. That's helpdesk at typha.com. The Joey T. Type of Volunteer of the Year Award. Recognize your volunteer. All right, here we go, second quarter action. First down for the Rockets. In the shotgun, takes the snap. Look at the pass. And he's looking to the far side. He'll send it up. He's got a man open and in and out of the hands. Number seven, the intended receiver. But we got a penalty flag over here on the far side. And they're gonna call an illegal man downfield on the Rockets. Number 99 was the man, Khalil Wilkes, was the uh, violator downfield. So it'll remain first down, back him up five yards, first and 15. Takes the snap, steps back, looking to pass. Sends it up on the far side. It's caught, and he'll get to the 30, to the 40. Cuts inside to about the 45. Number 39 on the catch, Samuel Harris, and that'll be good for another Rockets first down. No score between the Predators and Rockets Division I junior matchup here. Winner decides the district. There we go. First down for the Rockets. Shotgun. Takes the snap. Hands it off. Comes here to the near sideline. Breaks one tackle. Still on his feet. And this time he'll get wrapped up, stacked up, taken down on the far sideline. And looks like he may lose some yardage on the play. See where the spot is at. Nope, it'll be no gain. Second down and 10 for the Rockets. And good to see number 22, uh, Levi Dashnia, up on his feet with his helmet on. Looks like he's almost ready to come back into the game. Shotgun. Takes the snap. Steps back. Looking to pass. Sends it up here on the near far sideline. And it's caught. And he'll step out of bounds just short of the 40-yard line. Number 23 for the Rockets. That's going to be Jaden Perez on the catch. And they'll spot him, looks like, at about the 42-yard line. And that'll be good for another Rockets first down. Up 
Apparently you didn't apparently you didn't hear me. I just said that. I'll say plenty. I'll say plenty. Timeout called on the field. Timeout on the field called by the Predators. We'll step away, take that timeout, keep it here. We'll be right back here on Time for Radio. All Star. All Star. All Star Inflatable, a premier custom manufacturer of cold air inflatables. And they know what big time Texas football is all about. They specialize in team spirit tunnels. Inflatable helmets, mascots, bounce houses, and much, much more. They also do repairs. No job is too big or too small for All-Star Inflatables. With over 35 years of combined experience, their goal is to create, design, and manufacture top quality inflatables at affordable prices. All-Star Inflatables is proud to manufacture 100% in Texas, 100% made in the USA. All-Star Inflatables is a proud sponsor of the Texas Youth Football and Cheer Association. Typha organizations, let them know you're with Typha and get 10% off. See their ad at... All right, welcome back. Here we go. Fumble on the play. Picks up by the quarterback number 11, and he's going to sack. Elijah Favela gets sacked in the back of the lose about five yards on the play. First down, second down, and 15 coming up. Taken down for the Rockets. Now I'm being blamed for a wet ball. Takes the snap. Steps back. Looking to pass. Looks over the field. In trouble. And he'll get sacked again by the Predators. Number 66 for the Predators. Andrew Perez with the sack. And they'll spot the ball, looks like, at about the 45-yard line of the Rockets. Back in the pistol, two wideouts on each side. Single back set, takes the snap, looking to pass. He'll send it in the flat, it's caught. Comes here to the far side, and he'll get driven out of bounds. Gain of maybe a yard. Spotted about the 46, is gonna bring a fourth down for the Rockets. Elijah Favela comes in with the play. And now a timeout called this time by the Rockets. So Rockets will call a timeout. We'll step away, take that timeout with them. Keep it here. We'll be back here on Typha Radio. More action coming your way. In an effort to recognize scholastic excellence, Typha created the Scholastic Awards Program. The Sean Anthony Richardson Academic Excellence Team was established after eight-year-old Sean who played for the league in 2003 in the rookie division, tragically passed away on January 1st of 2004 in a vehicle accident. His parents were longtime friends of the Typha founders. The winners of this award will receive a hundred dollars, a certificate of accomplishment, and a congratulatory letter from Typha. In addition, the winners' names will be placed on the Typha website in the Hall of Fame. Those that qualify but do not win will receive a congratulatory letter from Typha as an honorable mention. To qualify, a child must be ages 8 to 13 for football players and 8 to 15 for cheerleaders as of August 1st of the current year. They must have a 98% or better GPA, be participating in the rookie, junior, or senior levels, and meet all other requirements set forth in the rules. 
If one or more of your players or cheerleaders qualify, send their information with supporting info to helpdesk at typha.com. That's helpdesk at typha.com. The Sean Anthony Richardson Academic Excellence Team, awarding excellence in the classroom. Here we go, fourth down play, takes the snap, look at the pass. Sends it up here on the far sideline, it's caught! He'll get to the 20, to the 10, and he'll get tripped up and into the end zone, touchdown! Number 22 for the Rockets, Levi Dashnia comes back in the football game and makes the catch for the touchdown. Extra point try coming up for the Rockets. Didn't think I could move that good, huh? <laughs> Extra point try under center, takes the snap, hands it off. He'll try to go straight up the middle. He'll get in. 7-0 is our score as the Rockets strike first in this football game. And we've got an injured player on the field for the Rock for the Predators. So an injured player for the Predators. 7-0 is our score. Keep it here. We'll step away real quick. We'll be right back. Monarch Trophy Studio in San Antonio, a leader in the awards and recognition industry since 1972. Their mission is to provide their customers with a wide variety of high quality, competitively priced awards. They have awards for sports, scholastics, employment, you name it, they've got it. Trophies, plaques, badges, pins, and much, much more. With the advancements in technology and the internet, Monarch Trophy Studio has quickly become one of the leading premier online award retailers. Monarch Trophy Studio is a proud sponsor of the Texas Youth Football and Cheer Association and proud provider of all TIFA awards, including the Dale Morgan Trophy. Visit Monarch Trophy Studio in their 30,000 square foot state-of-the-art production facility located at Highway 281 in Thousand Oaks in San Antonio, Texas. Contact them toll-free at 1-800-364-7903 or by email at sales at mtsawards.com. Check them out on their interactive website at www.mtsawards.com. That's mtsawards.com. Monarch Trophy Studio in San Antonio. Come get your trophy at Monarch Trophy. Rockets about to send the ball back to the Predators. They strike first here in this football game in the second quarter. Here comes the kick. It's an onside kick. It'll be recovered by the Predators. They'll try to return it here to the near sideline. Gets past one. He's got a blocker in front of him. And he'll take the block. Breaks free here on the near sideline. He'll get slung out of bounds just short of the 40-yard line. Number three for the Predators. Tyson Shamseed Dean with the return. They'll spot it about the 42-yard line. First down for the Predators. Rocket strike first on a nice pass play on the far side of the field to number 22, who was injured earlier, Levi Dashnia. Wasn't sure if he's going to return, but he did return and gets the score, the touchdown. 7-0 is our score. Rockets with the lead. Predators with the ball in great field position. Here come the Predators. Takes the snap, hands it off, and off tackle. Number 33 on the carry, that's Jason Love. 